So there's this funny misconception about Canadians that we all have one accent. Now, I was prompting this video, I recently watched a video about how different accents form and it's, you know, ma mainly geographical distances. Um, you know, people from different places geographically over time evolve to talk differently. So, you know, as you know, like a small country like England has different uh, accents, although that one's less known. But even in the States, people know that if you're from Boston, you're going to talk different than if you're from Texas. Yet, when it comes to Canada, the whole world thinks we all just talk the same, and it's not even how most Canadians talk, even. The way I'm talking is the way most Canadians do talk, but... In the second largest country geographically, there's going to be some different accents depending on where you live, especially considering that Canada has two official languages, English and French. So in, when it comes to English accents, there's a variety of accents depending on where you come from. And even when it comes to French accents, there's a variety of accents from where you come from. For example, if you're in Gatineau, the people talking French are going to sound a lot different than the people from Montreal. Gatineau accents are the ones that are kind of made fun of all the time by Anglo, the uh, Anglo-Canadians because they uh, talk like this in the Quebecer and the uh, they always have the uh sound with everything they say and they, they're just slang every other word like if you, you know, went to school and learned French and everything else and you come to Gatineau and try to speak French with some of these people you won't have a word what they're saying like if you came from France, your first language is French and you come to Gatineau and then you try to talk to these people in French they'll just, eventually you'll both give up and speak English <laughs> because they're just horrid anyways and then in Montreal it's a it's a little closer to France French because yeah like French from France is way different than French Canadian French so there's that too just like English from England is way different than English from North America and in the English accent now the stereotypical Canadian accent um, is actually Ottawa Valley accent. Ottawa Valley is basically all the rural cities and towns that are west of Ottawa because east of Ottawa is Quebec. Anyways, and pretty much now I live in Ottawa, so you know I've heard some people with the the you know stereotype. Okay, I never I didn't think those people existed until I met some people from Ottawa Valley, and I'm like, so that's where that accent comes from. Now, as you can imagine, the rural area just west of the uh, nation's capital isn't a shit ton of people. Now, there's some other places in rural Ontario that also talk like that and I've heard a few places in Manitoba apparently but for the most part it's just mostly in that kind of just not quite fully eastern Ontario but just a little bit west of eastern Ontario and then there's the Newfie accent people here in the Newfie accent just like how stupid people sometimes mix up the Australian accent with the British accent people here in the Newfie accent probably think that they're here in an Irish accent because a Newfie accent no Newfie Newfie is someone from Newfoundland, which is a Newf Newfoundland. Even as Canadian, I'll say Newfoundland instead of Newfoundland. Even though most people say Newfoundland, but anyways, it's a it's a maritime province. Anyways, down the maritimes, you got all sorts of different accents. Now, my grandmother's a Newfie, so of course, the family parties, Newfie jokes all over the place. Newfie jokes are like blonde jokes, only told with a Newfie accent, so you can barely understand what they're saying. <laughs> because oh, new, uh, new feature people talk funny, don't you buy? <laughs> and they say buy at the end of everything. Um, like, I'll, I'll try to find a good video with an example of a new fee accent, but you can't understand a damn word they're saying. <laughs> it's hilarious. Um, I, I can understand it a bit better than others because my grandmother's a newfie, but oh, it's hilarious to listen to a newfie person. It's the drunk, okay, so basically, a newfie accent is like a drunk Irishman mixed with a stereotypical Canadian accent. And then that's a new feast. You try to understand that shit. It's hilarious. So it's kind of funny that there's so little that's known about Canada, but so much that's known about like US or England or Australia even. Like Canada's all like we're the second largest country in the world, but of course we're all identical and everything else. We have two official languages and our terrain differs from deserts to tundra, but oh, we're all the fucking same, right? <laughs> So yeah, it's kind of funny that Canada kind of gets all lopped into one kind of thing, even though, I mean, we have an ocean on either side, we got Arctic tundra up north, we have the uh, Alberta Badlands, which is a legit desert, and then we have all sorts of forest uh, area, and then we got the prairies, and then we got the maritime area, like, there, oh yeah, we got the Rockies, and like, there is no consistency at all in our entire country. So... Yeah, it's kind of weird that everyone thinks that we're all the same. Anyways, thanks for listening. I thought this was be fun to talk about.